what's going on you guys so this weekend we got a fight coming up clarissa shields versus savannah marshall and one may say it's a rematch from something that happened over a decade ago right about 10 years ago over 10 years ago maybe um they fought in the amateurs clarissa shields back then was a, a kid teenager right um savannah marshall won the fight but if you go back and watch the fight savannah marshall really didn't win that fight but they gave it a victory nonetheless and now that's been something that's been a, a thorn of clarissa shields side it was since then but now she finally gets to redeem herself this weekend september 10th against her nemesis savannah marshall also on the undercard we got michaela mayer versus alicia Baumgartner unification fight should be a really 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 good fight it's also a, 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 a all women's event all women's event so it should be a lot of the ladies should be out here supporting the ladies right the ladies should be out here supporting the ladies this weekend um for this for this fight right should be a really good fight now savannah marshall is 12 and 0 with 10 knockouts she's known as a puncher right um uh, shields is 12 and 0 with two knockouts she's known as a boxer so this is a boxer versus a puncher type fight but if i'm honest um unless savannah marshall improved significantly since her amateur days um Clarissa shields is a different animal right she's matured uh, she's had gained a lot more experiences there not to mention she's already a two-time gold medalist but um everything else that she's done as a professional leading up to this point you know with only 12 fights Clarissa shields seems to have a whole career's worth of accomplishments and accolades so yeah she's done a, a lot in the sport in a very short period of time she is the self-proclaimed quote and i believe she is the quote she's going to go over there to united kingdom now this is something me for me early on um i i wasn't too um i didn't really necessarily like the idea of her going over there to the uk like that right i didn't necessarily like that idea but uh she's doing it right she's doing it she's going over there of course it's probably a much bigger fight over there anyway right so she's going over there to o2 arena going against her nemesis the silent assassin savannah marshall and as you can see here is all the ladies on the card um i see daniel dubois sister here you know she's an up and coming um i believe she's a prospect right now so yeah daniel dubois the fighting family from the uk um she's fighting probably the third fight on the card before we get to the co-main right so it's gonna be a number of ladies fighting the only thing i don't like about women's boxing because the ladies fight hard they fight really really hard but the only thing i don't like is that the two minute rounds you know you you have an action-packed fight you having a very exciting fight these ladies be throwing down you know fem women they fight with a lot of more emotion right so they be fighting really really hard and going at it with their all right no matter what and those rounds be a snap of a finger so much action the rounds be over less knockouts that way but you got somebody like savannah marshall who's still out here starching girls and i i think i think they share a common opponent um if i'm not mistaken um correct me if i'm wrong there i think they share a common opponent and i believe that savannah marshall actually stopped that chick versus shields taking her to a decision so yeah that shows the power difference there you know they say savannah marshall's one of the heaviest hitting female fighters in the world and as you can see here on the screen this is the co-main event alicia Bumgarner versus michaela mayer now for me um alicia Bumgarner kind of came out of nowhere if i'm honest she came out of nowhere you know um let me see she came out of nowhere it's like i just heard about her all the guys start posting pictures of her you know she's like a model and everything so she really knows how to take pictures and um she kind of came out of nowhere for me so I, I can't quite say if I know she's gonna beat Michaela Mayer, who I'm more familiar with, right? Michaela Mayer, she's been doing her thing. And now this is the biggest moment of her career, right? So it should be a really, really, really interesting night of fights, man. The only thing I'm not liking about it heading in is the fact that it's just two minute rounds. Cause I know these ladies are about to throw down, right? Salute the champ side. Let's see, uh, she says Savannah Marshall did bring her belt. Yeah, Savannah Marshall didn't bring her belt. You know, she says she don't even act like a champion. Clarissa Shields is trolling and talking a lot of trash. Hopefully, things go her way this weekend. I always ran for the USA. 
But hopefully things go her way because she was doing a lot of trash talking. And a silent little assassin, if I'm honest, she hasn't been saying too much of anything, if anything at all. Look at her. I mean, she looked like she don't talk. So, I mean, you can look at the expressions here on the screen. Um, Christian Shields, you could tell, you know, one way more outspoken than another just by the the, the, the appearances here. So, yeah, um, Christian Shields going to have to really back it up in there. You know, she said things like um, that she's going to come out hot and she's going to come out hot and stick her chin right out and and, and and do all that. It was like, oh, my goodness. Well, no, no, don't do that. No, don't 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 do that. OK, you know, she she was going for the knockout this fight. Christian Shields seems to be pretty amped up about this whole situation. And then she's finally get to get revenge on somebody um, that beat her years ago. She said, Christian Shields has... It says here, Clarissa Shields has fought 101 professional rounds and outlanded her opponents in 99 of them. She has not been outlanded in her last 69 rounds. Yes, Clarissa Shields is one of the best fighters in the world. Definitely the best female fighter in the world. But she's going to have to prove that claim this weekend against her rival Savannah Marshall. Should be a really good fight, you guys. Um, Alicia Baumgartner, Michaela Mayer, who do I got? Um shoot i don't know man i i i, I i'm leaning towards bum gardener even though i'm more familiar with mckay mayor and i know she's going to come to fight and she could win the fight um some of this bum gardener just looks like a just she's just looking too strong she might be too strong for at least um michaela mayor you guys i'm, I'm not sure i don't know she might be too strong for her unless michaela mayor fights the fight of her life and uses a a pure boxing bout right but uh we're gonna have to see you know we're gonna see i'm like i said i'm i'm, I'm not too familiar with alicia Bumgarner, so yeah um but I, some telling me she may pull it off this weekend some telling me i don't know i could be wrong and then of course the main event savannah marshall clarissa shields um going into the fight i wasn't too enthused or thrilled about it simply because Carissa Shields is who she is in the sport and what she's done. And she's taking her belts and everything she's done to go over there to fight her. A person who, let's be honest, at 31 years old, she hasn't really done nearly as much as Clarissa Shields has done. So, um, but she's going over there nonetheless. You know, it's a bigger fight over there. Boxing is big over there in the UK. And it should be a great fight, however long it lasts. I got Clarissa Shields winning the fight. I hope she keeps her head on straight in the fight, though. You know, you know, females, women, they can get a little emotional and she can get out of herself and, and, and kind of get out of her game plan. And as you can see here, the silent assassin, she really ain't saying much. And she knows she don't got to say much. Just had that little look on her face. And that alone seems to piss Clarissa Shields off. So, yeah. Um, oh, another thing. If Savannah Marshall didn't improve her inside game, it's going to be a really, really rough night for her. You know, because Clarissa Shields um despite her not having the ko's um she's a she's a hell of a boxer hell of a boxer so um and she could fight from all ranges as well so yeah um savannah marshall better have tightened up her inside game we're gonna see if her power is really the real deal they say she's the heaviest hitting female boxer in the world today we're gonna find out this weekend tell me what you guys think like subscribe hot your boy peace out